guys, it's Soja Girl, and this is my 35 week update, and I'm super excited, and I want to do a little happy dance with my little, my little baby bump, because I'm excited. Uh, 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 are you excited, baby Josiah? You are? Mommy's more excited to meet you. Okay, guys, so, again, this is my 35 week update. I am 36, 36 point, 36 weeks in uh two days as of today as far as my baby app um someone was ask, asking me um which app i follow which is just the baby bump app as of today he is 18.75 inches long and he is 5.75 pounds which is cool because he's almost six pounds and i'm so excited about that and i feel like he's taking up all the space in there like, for the most part, I really feel like he doesn't have enough space. Um, I noticed that this week he's been having the hiccups a ton, which is the cutest thing because it's like, I literally just sit there and I just watch my stomach just, like, kind of pulsate as he, as he has, as he hiccups. And, uh, again, it's the, the most cutest, adorable thing ever. I really feel super, super swollen. I feel like I'm retaining, like, a crap load of water. I was playing with my niece yesterday, and I was, like, I was pressing into my leg, you know, and, uh, like firmly with my thumb and Tori like left my imprint there and she was like that is so freaking gross auntie and so um and so yeah so I noticed that uh, when I cross my legs I usually cross them at the, my lower leg uh, whatever leg is is um underneath is left with this imprint from the, the top leg which is so flipping gross um I'm still drinking plenty of water I got myself this super <laughs> cute water bottle from CVS for like I think it was like two dollars to help me get my water in um i have no food cravings i wouldn't i don't honestly i can't really say i've had food cravings at all like i if i want to eat something i'm going to eat something i don't necessarily refer to it as a craving um i haven't had any problems you guys have been sleeping like a baby lately again still taking my naps um i am um still walking four miles a day i had a cut a short Yesterday, I had to cut my, my walk short because I got caught in the rain. And so, um, I think I only cut it by half a mile, but I've been pretty much doing four miles a day. Um, most days a week, I would say five days a week I'm doing that. Um, I'm not doing anything else as far as working out is concerned. And I feel really, really, really great when I'm out, as long as I hydrate myself really well. Again, I'll, I'll eat a banana before I go and um, guzzle down a, a, a bottle of water. I'm usually okay with that and I take some water with me. I've been having crazy heartburn um, and I know they say that that means your baby's gonna have a head full of hair. I don't know but when I had David I had bad heartburn as a reflex whatever you want to call it and um, after I had him I still had like episodes of, of heartburn um, based on whatever I ate, if I ate foods that were too acidic, or I couldn't eat red sauces and um, acidic fruits and stuff like that. And so, but this time, of week, this last week, I've noticed that I've had heartburn a lot. I've been tumming it up, <laughs> tumming it up, literally. Um, I keep Tums in my car, on my bedside, in my purse. Um, I have a roll in my coupon binder, like... I, I'm just trying to stay prepared because there's nothing like heartburn or acid reflex and when you have nothing to alleviate that or relieve the, the, that discomfort. I decided to do you guys, I decided to put my co my um, my um coconut oil in a spray bottle and so and it just makes it easier to just spray it and just kind of rub it in. It just makes it so much easier than sticking my whole hand into the damn jar. Um, and using it that way and so this just makes it easier because like literally as soon as I get off the shower I just spray myself down and rub things down really really good and I'm good to go um, my stomach has been super freaking itchy this last week like I have to like try my hardest not to scratch um, and so I'll, again I'll grab something my coconut oil my bio oils also on my my nightstand and I'll just rub my stomach down really quick um, but it's been super, super itchy. He has been like balling up a lot and it's so uncomfortable. And again, like I did, like I told you guys, I usually do, I'll just get on my ball and kind of bounce around a little bit and that'll kind of get him to loosen up and to kind of relax a little bit. 
I cannot wait, you guys, to get back into working out. Like, uh, like I cannot wait to really go hard at the gym. I cannot wait. I really can't. Uh, I cannot wait. I don't have any mommy buys this week. I haven't had mommy buys actually for a while. Like, all I really bought, I did buy maternity pens, which was different from when I had David, because when I had David, I didn't buy any maternity clothes. Um, even though my weight was a lot higher with him, I haven't gained any weight at all in the last two weeks. Because when I went to the doctor, um, at the last time was just almost two, it was a little over two weeks ago. I was a certain weight. <laughs> I'm still that certain weight as of yesterday morning, so I haven't gained any weight. Um, I'm 194, and I'm just like, I don't feel it, but I just don't like the scale. Like, if I didn't have to weigh myself ever, 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 I wouldn't, and I wouldn't even care. Um, and so that's one thing, I haven't gained any weight in two weeks, which I don't think that's a problem because I've gained so much weight so far, so it's like, I could care less that I haven't gained, you know, in the last two weeks or not. I have baby bites to share with you guys. I did not share with you guys in my last video because I forgot <laughs> and partially was just too lazy to go downstairs and bring everything up. And so all of this stuff here, I I actually used a gift card. I think it was when I bought a gift card um, that I had for Walmart. And all of this stuff was on clearance. And so, again, some really, really cute, awesome little deals that I got. I'll tell you guys, I, you guys know that I'm a couponer and I'm always down for saving money whenever I can. And I wish I had this mindset when I had my when I had a little man, um, because I would have saved so much money. It's it's not even funny. All right, so what I'm gonna show you guys the stuff that I got for him. All right, so I, I got this little two pack of little mittens, for and they were like 50 cents. Okay, I got him a little blue hat, which is cute, and I should have gotten um, the army fatigue one because I th I think that one will look really really cute on him too. But this was only 50 cents, and I actually think this was a dollar for the little cap. Um, I got him a little polo onesie, and I think this was a dollar. I found two packs of socks. Um, one is, this one is 6 to 12 months, and then this one is 2 to 3T. And these are basically 2 bucks a piece, and they're both 6 count. Um, I found him this little wash mitten. It was, uh, I want to say it was, it was a dollar. Yeah, this was a dollar. And then a little white beanie that was 50 cents. Um, these little shorts. These are 12 months. Yeah, these are 12 months and these were a dollar. And the little shorts. I went ahead and got two of each. I got a uh, 3 6 and 0 3. So I got basically four pairs. And these were only a dollar. Then I looked, I scored on these outfits, these short sets, because they were all two dollars a piece, which is awesome. So I got this one, and they come with little shorts. This one here, okay. This one here. If you guys watch my coupon videos, then you probably already saw these because I shared them um, in one of my hauls. And then these, and I actually really like these colors, like these really bright pretty colors um totally cute and then I got him a bunch of onesies because you can never have too many onesies and zero three only one this one is zero three and okay yeah so yeah so I got him this one I'm not gonna read them all but this one and I think these were a dollar. And then this one. And then this one here. <laughs> this one here. This one here. And that little t-shirt. And then I found these little swim shorts. Um, and they were only a dollar. These were only a dollar too. And these are, two of them are 24 months. And one is, I think, 18. Yeah, 18 months. So this one is 18 months. And these two are 24 months. And I thought these were just too cute. Nothing he can wear anytime soon. But guess what? When he is 24 months and when he's 18 months, he's going to already have them. Um, and so that's all I really, that's all I got for this time around. I still need to do his, his nursery room, you guys. I am like so flipping clueless as far as decorating his room. What the theme should be. 
I haven't even gotten his 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 bedding yet, and so um, I'm trying. I'm gonna. I'm hoping I can work on his room in the next. I would say week. Hopefully the next week. Um, I did get him um, some curtains, some sheer white curtains, um, yesterday, and I'll probably put those up later today. Um, what else? Um, I have to move the um, playpen in here. The stroller with car seat needs to go downstairs, and then. The rocker room will probably also stay downstairs, but I'm not sure. I'm going to have to see if I can find a little table or something to sit it on because it's it sits on the floor. And with, with Bella, the dog, I don't want her, you know, getting all in the way. I'm not the type of person to have my dog all in the baby's face. That's just, I can never understand those who do that, but <laughs> I'm not that person to have the dog look in the baby's face. It's not going to happen. I don't kiss my dog. You know why? Because dogs lick their asses and they eat their poop and they yeah do disgusting things like that so um so that's that and other than that I think that is it I'm gonna give you guys a really quick belly shot and it's crazy because I have a confession for you guys a lot of the tops I wear are dresses and I wear them as tops because <laughs> because I'm heavier and yeah so this is actually a dress and it's funny because I told Tay my niece I said Tay I said you know this is a <laughs> this is a dress she was like no it's not auntie that's not no dress that wouldn't even I mean, your ass would be hanging out I said no this is a dress when I bought it it was a dress okay it was a dress okay when you're size two four it's a flipping dress but when you're freaking any bigger than that it's a top so for me right now it's, this is a top, but it's usually a dress. Um, and so, let me give you guys a belly shot really quick. <sighs> of me. Me belly. Uh, That's my belly right there. Whew. I noticed that little line is a lot darker, too. Somebody asked if I had my belly bump. I did have my belly bump pierced a long time ago. I actually took it out, actually, when I had a little man. And I just, honestly, just never put it back in. But you can see my little scar right there where I had it pierced. This is my belly. Huh. Look at that. Okay. This is the other side. You know, a lot of people keep telling me I look small for 30, uh, for 36 weeks. A lot of people keep telling me that. And I'm like, I don't actually feel big. Like, I don't feel like my stomach is actually big. Sometimes I feel like it is, but for the most part, I feel like I don't feel like it's it's big. Especially when I'm... I think it looks bigger when it's naked. When it's bare. But when I have clothes on, I don't feel like it's, um, it's very big. But yeah, so... So yeah, so that's basically it, you guys. Uh, I want to thank you guys that are, have been following me with this journey of mine's. Um, because I understand that everybody's not going to really dig, you know, pregnancy vlogs and stuff, but I am really appreciative and grateful for those of you who have watched all my videos and those of you who comment. Um, I mean, it means a lot to me. It really, really does. And so I just want to thank you guys. Um, and so, yeah. So I shall leave it there and I will see you guys all in the next update, which will be next week, you guys, which means I will be two weeks. Oh my gosh. Like, that is, you know, one thing I'm going to add before I, uh, before I let, you, let you guys go, because I'm sweating, I'm hot. I have been so flipping emotional, like, uh, I went, this is, this is stupid, this is, uh, I went to get my car smogged, alright, and it failed, and I literally started, my eyes started bawling out with, 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 with tears, like, I was gonna flipping cry, <laughs> know why I was just like why am I gonna cry right now I had no reason but the flipping hormones because why would I cry over something like that that like and then I go to the DMV and I I went to DMV and um what was I don't know what what I had to do that day oh I had to pay my tags and I had to get a, a pass for the car okay and I was like okay well I don't want to 
have to get a pass every single day, so I'm going to go ahead and just get a 30-day pass, right? Which I actually didn't get the 30-day pass because I don't drive my car every day, and if I have to drive it, then I have to go get a pass, right? And so I came out from taking care of all that and got in my car and started fucking crying. Like, why am I flipping crying? Like, <laughs> it was so... It was so dumb, you guys. I felt so stupid. I'm in my car, like, crying. Like, why am I crying for? Like, I totally had to flipping check myself. Like, Chanel, why the, are you crying for? Like, I, yeah. So, the hormones, are my emotions, you know, I, I'm just like, what the heck? So, but that's, that's the last thing I'm going to say. I'll leave it there. Again, thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Um, and I will see you guys all in the next update.